out at downtown State College to ask your classmates, your peers, what is their biggest... Silencing women during Women's History Month, crazy. Penn State, period. Anyway, we're downtown. We're gonna ask people about relationships. Hey, can I ask you guys a quick question? Of course. Can you give me a past relationship story that's not the best? Um, I got kicked out of my ex-boyfriend's house when I had nowhere to go, and he threw all of my out onto the street, and then wouldn't let me get in my car to leave. And then, yeah. <laughs> It was I'm, terrible. I'm so Don't sorry. Stay in a toxic relationship. Absolutely. Oh yeah, my gosh. Terrible. I'm so sorry. And then he cheated on me. Ooh, he really doubled down. I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry. Yeah. Give me an ick from a past relationship. Uh, karaoke. Karaoke? Yeah. Okay. Do you do karaoke? I love karaoke. All right. Awesome. So karaoke is good and bad in some cases. What is your biggest ick? My what? Biggest ick. Women have an ick list. Yo, yeah, if they talk about the icks, they got a problem. I yo, I agree with him. When he burps and it's like, like that. Oh my God, if you can't, oh, if people can't listen. Real. Just when I'm telling you a story, uh -huh. don't ask me to start from the beginning three times. What is your worst relationship story? They cheated on me. Bad. How could they do so? You never know. They, you never know. That's so awful. You never know. But you know what? You dodged a bullet. Yeah. She how, had, about, how about you? She had three baby mama, the baby daddies. Whoa. Three. Three. Wow. This is so like Mama Mia. No. This took a turn. She was trying to make me the fourth. I was like, no, no, no kids, no, no kids. Yo, no. no, the female Nick Cannon. Thank you guys for. <laughs> Hello everyone. I'm here with Joey. Joey. What is like a big ick you have in a relationship? Bro, when they're like, when they're awkward, you know what I mean? Like when they don't know how to make a conversation. That's what, I, I, I like talking, communicating. That was a perfect answer. That's the most real answer we've seen all night. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Of course. Okay, basically these two, they're here for a basketball tournament, I think, from like a high school and middle school. They have to be 14, maybe. And they asked us if there was an ice cream place nearby. I'm so sorry, boys. I don't know. What is your biggest ick in a relationship? Um, being called uh, boss or bro. <gasps> Mine is just like if they smell bad. I guess like bad Real. hygiene. Yes. I agree. I agree. Yeah. yeah thank bad you. Bad hygiene sucks. No. <laughs> oh, the hygiene. Sucks. Well, <laughs> these women then pitched us the idea to ask men on the street to name a woman because when put on the spot they can't. So naturally we had to try it out. Name a woman. <laughs> Told you. <laughs> ew. Ew. Me? Okay. Period. Nice. Cop out, cop out answer. <laughs> you were right. I told you, they can't name women. What we've learned, men don't know how to name women. Uh, biggest icks are real, and like, but also sometimes they're not real. I don't know. And um, there's no ice cream shops <laughs> uh, open at 10.45 p.m. that will serve to 12-year-olds. Uh, I don't know if you're 12, boys. I'm sorry. That was, I'm really bad with ages. You could be 14.